Congratulations, you made it to work again. Whether you think about it or not, in order to get here, you just went through what is statistically one of the most dangerous parts of our world, our nation's streets and highways. And now you're here, you're safe. Well, not quite, because you're entering what is statistically the most hazardous part of our building, the stairwell. This is not the time to let down your guard. It's still time to be safe. We continue to work to design and maintain stairs in our building to be as safe as we can, providing proper lighting, installing treads that are engineered with good traction, solid handrails, and windows in the fire room. But there's one safety factor that we can't buy, and that's how people actually use those stairs. So that's why we made this video, to dramatize some of those things people do that contribute to mishaps and to those statistics. The leading cause for mishaps? Not paying attention and being in a hurry. It's also important to remember that the rules of the road apply to the stairwells as well. Stay to the right. It prevents traffic jams and collisions. And here's another common hazard, the spilled coffee. What do most people do when they spill something on the stairs? Right. They look around to see if anyone else saw them. And then they leave. But that just sets the scene for another mishap. And what should you do if something spilled? Warn other people right away, then get it cleaned up. Here's another situation. I think that would be great if we could get together and talk about that issue. You need to head to the boardroom. Oh, You're thank you. Room. I'm really sorry I'm late for a meeting. Can I give you a call back? I'll try to get a hold of you this afternoon. Thanks, bye. Uh-oh, Sandy's running late again. hurry again, wasn't she? Here's one more example of what can and quite often does happen. Here are two more very common mistakes people make on the stairs. First, not using the handrail, and second, carrying things that restrict their vision. We've had quite a few reported injuries to backs, knees, and ankles from people who thought there was another step left when in fact they had reached the landing. You're carrying something that interferes with your vision and requires both hands. Take the elevator. It'll stop when it's supposed to. And finally, we have a situation that doesn't come up very often. But when it does, it has a lot of potential for getting people hurt. It's what happens when the evacuation alarm goes off. What is this person doing? Probably going back to their desk to get their car keys or their purse. That creates a dangerous situation for everyone. Everyone is hurrying to get out of the building. They don't know if it's a drill or a real emergency. And only the people in the front of the pack know why there's a slowdown. The ones behind are pushing forward. Remember the stairways are, statistically, the most hazardous locations in our building. But you can be safe by following a few basic rules. Pay attention, don't rush, obey the rules of the road and stay to the right. Clean up spills, use the handrails, and watch where you're stepping. Open the door slowly and watch out for other people. And if the alarm goes off, go with the flow. Evacuate the building as the rules say you should. When the alarm sounds and it's time to evacuate the building, persons with mobility issues, either temporary or permanent, need to go to the north stair tower, which is the glass stair tower. 
and they will be staged in that area until a determination has been made as to whether or not we need to evacuate the building. If evacuation is necessary, you will be assisted down by your partner or members of the Urban Search and Rescue Team. And while you're there and staged there, a member of management will stay with you at all times, therefore you're kept informed as to what's happening and what needs to be done. Remember, we are LNI. We're supposed to set the example for the rest of the state. We're supposed to be safe. Gil, what do you think? Third chain? 